Welcome back to my channel my name is Jenny Allen and before we get started with today's video please make sure that you are subscribed that you turn on your notifications and that you thumbs up this video so welcome to prayer Mondays and our prayer today is going to be based on Philippians 419 which is one of my favorite verses Philippians 419 Philippians 419 so I'm going to be reading it in the Amplified Bible and it says and my God will liberally supply fill to the full your every need according to his riches in glory in Christ Jesus and my God will liberally supply and today we're going to be praying about the supply of God for this week because God has promised to supply all our needs and needs as we are you know, as as you're watching this video, the needs of the people that are watching will be varied. Some have financial needs, some have spiritual need, some have emotional need, some have business needs, some have employment needs. Some have relational needs, relational needs, emotional needs that are most probably not being met. So right now we're going to pray based on Philippians 4.19. We are going to pray for God to supply. God has promised to supply and we're going to pray for that supply. Father God, I thank you this morning that we're praying according to your word, Philippians 4.19. Father, you have promised to supply. Lord, our needs according to your riches in glory by Christ Jesus. Father, we're grateful this morning that the need to supply is not based on what we have, but the need to supply is based on your riches. It is based on what you have and what, your, what you can give to us. Father, right now I commit every hearer every person watching this video into your hands. I pray, Lord God, that you will supply financial needs this week. I pray, Father God, that where people are looking for finances to pay rent, where people are looking for finances to pay, to pay bills, to pay school fees, to buy groceries, to pay their mortgage, to buy food, I pray, Father God, that you will supernaturally supply their need in the name of Jesus. I pray, Father God, that those who have emotional and relational needs, I pray, Lord God, that you will supply from your riches in glory. Father, in Christ Jesus, supply and meet their emotional and rela relational needs in the name of Jesus. I pray, Lord, that where there is a gap, where there is a hole in their emotions, where there is a lack, where there is a need in their emotions. I pray, Father God, that by your Holy Spirit, that you will come and minister to that area in their lives, Father, that you will come and minister into that need in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray for needs that people have at work. I pray for business needs. Father, I pray that you will give your people creative ideas. Father, that your riches in glory will meet them at the point of their need. I pray, Father God, that as they walk in obedience this week, I pray, Lord, that you will send somebody that you will send someone to minister to them to at their point of need, that somebody will come with a word in season that will touch their heart and it will be an answer to the prayers, Lord, that they have been praying. I pray, Father God, that those who desire a closer walk with you, those who desire to walk closer to you, Father, I pray, Lord, that you will minister to them and that, Lord, as they come and they prepare themselves, Lord, to meet you daily, on a daily basis, Lord, that you will meet them in that place, Lord, that you will meet them in at the altar 
that they have prepared, Lord, for you. I pray, Father God, that you will meet your people. I pray, Father God, that you will shower them with your blessings this week. I pray, Father God, that where their hearts have been broken, Father Lord, that you will come and mend the brokenhearted. Father, you promised that you came to set the captives free, that you came to mend the brokenhearted. And I pray, Lord, that you will come and minister to each individual where they need you at this moment in time. I pray, Father Lord, that you will come and touch them, that you will counsel them, that you will minister to them, that you would advocate for them. Father, that you would, Father, that they will be guiltless before you in the name of Jesus. Father, I pray, for in Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen and amen. I pray that you are ministered to in this prayer and my prayer for you this week is that God will meet you at your point of need because he has promised to supply. He has promised to supply and the Bible also says that if a father knows how to give good gifts to his children, how much more the children of God, how much more us that loves God. So if God has promised to supply, he will supply. So God bless you and I'll see you in my next video. God bless.